Not by your hand. Okay. You only took Just one. Or orange. Or this one? Or this two colors. This? I like mine. Okay. I like the blue. Or this one. 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 You have to write first. You have to write the word. I have hidden your words in my heart. Can you write it? Do you want me to write for you? Look at this! Oh no, oh, it's oh, beautiful! Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, oh, good! Oh, when? Come here. Mommy can't spell when. Then. 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 Oh, look at that! Write your name! Oh, beautiful! Write your name! Okay, I'm gonna write mine! Okay, I'm gonna write mine! Can I have a pink one? Where is the pink one? Here you go, Let me see. You're not easy yeah. here. Uh, yeah. They could have been there. Uh, Ashley? <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Write <laughs> 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 my name. Okay, oh, Ella, no, wait, wait, wait. Write right my yeah. name, my yeah. mommy. We will write like my name. name. Yeah. Write my name. Hold on. Oh, very good. You got yours all done? Write my name. Okay. Oh, oh, I'm moving on the other side. So we seal all the sides except the very top. Right. Mm -hmm. And then we will. Okay. I'm trying to oh. yes. So we can put a string. Michael, come. come. Give that to me again, please. Thank you. The punch. Oh. Let's do it like yeah. this. Yeah. Let's do it like this. Let's do it like this. Let's do it like this. Oh, yeah. Oh, actually, we'll go this way. There you go. And then you can, you can hang this. Yeah, I'm too long. So you have to take it. See? Mommy, Shaggy is me. Oh, you like it? Oh, I like it. Uh oh. Do it hard. Oh, yeah. Stronger. Wow. 
Shuki, where's yours? New one, lady. Yeah, she knew a lady how to wear shorts. You need what? Like a four. I didn't ask about the I didn't ask about the memory verse. I asked about the lesson. No, it was baby Moses. It's about baby Moses. Wow. Now, can anyone tell me what the memory verse is? You are my hiding place. place. Psalm 37. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You'll find it eventually if you can read. Okay. Can we say that together? You are my hiding place. Psalm 32, 7. Yes, that's good. Who can say it all by themselves besides Ella? Okay, Greta. <laughs> <laughs> Who else can say it? I've got Michael, yeah. You? No! <laughs> Michael, how old are you? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Five. Oh, I heard it's something about her birthday sometime. Yeah. Yeah. Can anyone else say that? You are uh, my, my hiding, hiding place. place. Um, what does that mean? What's a hiding place? No one can find someone. That's a place where nobody can find you. Where you're safe, you're hidden from things that might try to get you. Where you want to be alone. Some, when you want to be alone. Sometimes we have something we don't want anyone else to find. Hiding. So when it says, you are my hiding place, who is it talking uh, to? Uh, Reuben took my headband away. Oh, he did. Okay, now, when we say, you are my hiding place, who are we talking about? Are we talking about mommy? When we say, you are my hiding place, can we go hide it, mommy? In oh, her tummy. somebody could find you. Well, you were hiding at one time in her tummy, but now you can't hide there anymore. Okay, so who are we talking about? God. About God. How can we hide? How is God our hiding place? You think about that. We'll talk about it in a few minutes, okay? At first, I want to tell, I want to ask you a question. How many of you have an angel that watches you? How many of you think you have an angel that watches you? Yeah. You have an angel that watches you when you have to sleep out in the veranda when the lightning comes, don't you? Yeah. An angel watches you. Yeah. You have an angel that watches you. <laughs> yes. You know. Little baby. Little baby Moses. Who had angels watching him. And in the land. In the Jordan River. In the land. Well, I don't think it was the Jordan River, but in the land where Moses lived. Who can put this on the. Can you do that, Mike? In the land where Moses lived, there was a king who sat on the throne. And he was a pharaoh. But right in the middle. He's sitting there. He's so important. And whatever Pharaoh said, that was the law. Everybody had to do it. And you know what? Was he a good king or a bad king? Do you remember? Bad king. He was a bad king. The Bible says he was a wicked man. And what did he do? He knew that Moses' family, that Moses' relatives, actually they were descendants from Jacob and Joseph who had come to live in Egypt and they were getting to be many, many, many people. And he said, oh dear, there's so many of those Israelis, they're going to take over Egypt one of these days. There's so many of them, what if our enemies come? And they join that side. Oh, there'd be too many. We must make sure there's no more. What shall we do? And they said, oh, if we make 
make them work very, very hard. They won't, they won't multiply like that. And so they made them slaves. They made them work very, very hard. How many of you have had to work very, very hard? Probably not. <laughs> but some of your mommies and daddies have. But not maybe as hard as these people had to work. But did God bless these people? Even though they had to work? Yes, they were poor. So the king said, oh, that's not working. And he, he tried again. He said, oh, anybody who helps these mommies have babies, they have a baby boy. We want them to, you know, that baby boy, but these ladies that were helping the mommies have babies. Did they kill those baby boys? No, they disobeyed this king. Do you know why? They disobeyed the king because they were obeying God. Yes, it's always good to disobey somebody who tells us to disobey God. It's better to obey God than to obey somebody else. And that's what they did. And the king called them in and said, Oh, you're not obeying me. And they made some excuse that they would obey God, not him. And God blessed them. Him. Then the king said, throw all the baby boys where? Into the river, the Nile River. Do you know what the Nile River has in it? Well, it has. I'll put it on, Daddy. It has. What are these? <laughs> grass. That's grass. You know it's called grass. Very good. Called bulrushes. You know what? The Nile River. How many people here have seen the Nile River? You know, grab that. Ruben, your mommy and I have seen the Nile River, and you know what it has besides bulrushes? It has bulrushes that are so tall. Some of them are, oh, higher than the ceiling. Welcome, welcome. But it also has crocodiles. And when you throw baby boys into the river, they don't last very long. So he said, throw all the baby boys into the river. That was the law. And baby Moses' mother said, okay, we'll throw our baby in the river. Is that what she said? <laughs> oh. He said, no, we don't want to throw our baby in the river. something that cries. Oh, people find out about it. I'm a crocodile. Yeah. Yeah, they're not very good to eat, are they? I like uh, crocodiles. You do? When did you eat a crocodile? <laughs> <laughs> did you eat a crocodile? Yeah, I don't like crocodiles. Anyway. I like crocodiles. Yeah, they're nice. They make good pets, don't they? Tell me again about this. I, 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 like, I like play crocodiles. Play crocodiles. Now listen, listen, <laughs> a baby that we get a lot of children So his mother made something, a basket, Shuki, yeah. would you put this basket up here by the door? No, no, you put, and Shuki, you come put the lid on the basket. Sit down. There, put the lid right on top of the basket, right up here. Okay. She made very good. She made a basket with a lid on it. And what? It's okay. What do you suppose she was going to put in that basket? Oh, sure enough. I want the baby. I want the baby. And she put the lid on it. And then, okay. Who, who gets to do this one? Who is this? This is the mother, and she took that right down, she took this basket right down to the river, right there, and she, and who didn't get to put one on yet? Who wants to put this one? She took Moses' sister, there you go, right there. 
And she went to me. Go watch. Go watch that. That basket. So now Moses had a sister watching him, but who else was watching? God. God had sent his angels to watch him too. And who should come down to the river? Princess. That a princess and Amaze. and Amaze. the princess May. She came down to the river and what did she see? A basket. A basket. And what did she say? What did she say? Maybe Moses. She told her helpers to go get the basket, and so they went and got the basket. And they brought it to her. And then what did she do? Open the lid. She opened the lid. And what did she find inside of that baby? Hey. Oh, and what did she say about that baby? She said, oh, this is one of those Israeli babies. We're going to throw him in the river? <laughs> no, she didn't say that. She said, I want to make this baby my baby. Now, was baby Moses saved? Yes, because not only was his sister watching him, and the angels were watching him, but they had sent this, this princess to watch him too. And she could do whatever she wanted. And he said, this baby will be saved. So he was saved because this lady wanted to make him very And what do you suppose happened? They needed someone to take care of this little baby and to feed this little baby. So his sister came and said, Well, oh, I know someone that can take care of the baby. And he said, okay, you go get her. And she went and got her mama. And they gave the baby right back to the mama and said, You watch that baby. You raise that baby. She said, Someday I'll take that baby and it will go to the palace. But until then, it's your baby. And what do you suppose this mama did when she got her baby back? She prayed because they had prayed and said, Oh, Jesus protected our baby. And so when Jesus had protected their baby, she prayed and said, What? Thank you, God. Thank you, God, for saving our baby. And they trained that baby to love God because someday that baby was going to do a big work for God. Okay, now, we started out by talking about a hiding place. You are my hiding place. And you know that? You said that that hiding place was God. Amen. How can we hide in God? Pray. You know how we can hide in God? Well, that's not a very easy way to hide in God. But you know, God will protect us from all evil if we trust Him. So by believing Him, we can hide ourselves in Him, and then we're safe from evil. That doesn't mean that some things bad won't happen to us. That means that evil will never own us, because we will always be God's children. Amen. Amen. Okay. Okay. Thank you. What's that? <laughs> so let's sing that. Offering time has come again. Put your one dollars in. Offering. That's the way to really please us when we bring our gifts to Jesus. Offering time is here again. Put your one dollars in. That's the way to really please us when we bring our gifts to Jesus. Offering takes too long. We will, we expect.
and our little song. Season lights it when we sing. As we play our offering. <laughs> Mommy needs. He's got one more verse. Baby needs. Yeah. We could sing another verse, but he's one. Yeah. Before we say it, that's too long. Okay. That's why okay. daddy needs mommy's a hiding place. Come on. The is hiding. Who makes a word? Michael, will you pray over our offering today? Oh. Baby girl. Leave, leave him. Leave her alone. You don't want to pray? Oh, thank you. Joshua, will you pray over our offering today? Uh, I don't take my offering today. But, but will you pray for our offering today? Okay. Can you do that? Okay, you pray for our offering. Okay, guys, we'll try. Okay. We are helping others and Yay! 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 Yay!
got her present today. So let's take this one down. Happy birthday, Hesta. Happy birthday. Oh, this is really tough. Next year, yours. Let's go.